Welcome back to another video. In today's video, I will show you how to fix Google sign-in errors in a Unity project to ensure it works smoothly on your Android. If you need a complete tutorial on Google sign-in, watch this video for a step-by-step -step login guide. So, in this video, we will fix Google sign-in errors. If Google sign-in isn't working for you, then this video is for you. Watch the complete video to get it fixed. First, go to build settings and make sure your minimum API level is set to Android 7.0 API level 24. Then, make sure your key store is added to the project. Then, check the streaming assets folder in your project and ensure that the JSON file is correctly added to the streaming assets folder. Then, go to the plugins folder, open the Android folder, and delete all libraries except the Firebase app. After deleting the files, if the Android Gradle template pop-up appears on the screen, click the Enable button. But before clicking the Enable button, I will show you the project publishing settings to ensure that all the file check options are currently disabled. Now, we are going to click on the Enable button. After enabling this, now we are going to resolve dependencies. To resolve dependencies, go to Assets External Dependency Manager, and then click on Android Resolver, and then click on Force Resolve. This will create three files in the Android folder. Now, go to Project Publishing Settings again and check on the Android Manifest file option. Make sure all these options are enabled in the Project Publishing Settings. Android Manifest file. Custom main Gradle template. Custom Gradle properties template. Custom Gradle settings template. So, if you follow all these steps, I hope everything will work fine for you. Now, create a build and test it. If the build still has issues and the login is not working, follow this last step. In the plugins folder, open the settings template file in VS Code. You will see a specific line where we need to add generate terapinom after assets. Basically, I don't know why, but the external dependency manager creates the wrong path, so we just need to correct this path. So, copy the generate terapo folder name and paste it into the settings template file, just as I am showing, and then save the file. Now, with this, your build will 100% work, and Google sign-in will function perfectly in your project. Just create a build and test it. Thanks for watching. If you found this helpful, hit the like button and subscribe to the channel for more awesome Unity tutorials. See you in the next video.